What's up, Cybertronians and uh, ladies? And uh, this is Trans Aaron 3 coming at you with some more Transformers action. Today we're taking a look at the brand new Transformers Earthrise War for Cybertron trilogy Astro Squad, which is Fuser and Autobot Blastmaster. They turn into a NASA space shuttle, which it says NASA on the side of it, which is pretty cool. I don't know if they do have it on their toy or not, but yeah. Uh, this is the MicroMaster. Uh, like uh, MicroMaster combiners, which is I actually have the original of these guys. Um, I have to dig them out here real quick so you guys have a nice comparison with the original. Um, yeah, so yeah, you get the Autobot, Autobot. Uh, ooh, 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 a little tired. Uh, you have the Autobot Blastmaster and Fuser, and uh, they transform in 16 steps. And um, they are the Astro Squad, which is awesome. And they can interact with Ironworks. There's a weird configuration how they have Ironworks there. So we'll get to that here in a little while. But uh, yeah, not much going on. It's like, uh, like I said, there was a nice uh, updated version of the MicroMaster Combiners. MicroMaster Transformers! <laughs> MicroMaster Combiners! <laughs> so yeah. I know, I'm being silly. But, uh, yeah. So this is the, the Transformers Earthrise Wars for Cybertron Trilogy Astro Squad. So, yeah, let's get these guys out of their box and see what they're all about. Alrighty, ladies and gentlemen, we got the Astro Squad out of their cardboard and plastic prison. And, uh, yeah, very cool right out of the box. And, uh, you also get your, uh, your uh, Autobot Blastmaster and Fuser. Get your instructions here. Nice and blue, which is awesome. And it shows them how the transformer combine together. And it's supposed to transform and go with ironworks. And then there's a map piece right here, which is pretty cool. Um, so if you got the little uh, red decoder piece here. We can actually look in here and see if there's anything in here that's going to decode for us. Whatever that is. Nothing really in there. But this is a map piece and uh, my buddy Input was saying I guess we're supposed to cut these map pieces out and stick them together. So, <laughs> um, yeah, I'm not going to be worried about that too well. But, uh, so yeah, anyway, you get you your nice instructions there with these guys, and uh, yeah, not so much going with the packaging. You can see they're in space. It's pretty cool. So yeah, so there's that other map piece that you can take out and add to your collection of the map pieces. <laughs> so yeah, moving right along, here is the Astro Squad in their robot mode, straight out of the box. Very cool, and. Uh, um, this one here is a little bit more top heavy. This guy here is a little bit more top heavy, unless you should flip the wings out. But, uh, but Fuser here, very nice with a red, silver on his face. He comes with blasters in his hand, so it's cool. But I'm going to call him if it was call him Blastmaster, but he's the end of the rocket, uh, the space shuttle, so he has all the thrusters, so you get it, Blastmaster. <laughs> But, uh, yeah, nice little MicroMaster. Not, not much going on. It's a, not much going on with these guys. You got ball jointed arms here. Um, he does have a race waist swivel here due to transformation. You gotta pull this. If you pull this up enough. Eh, race swivel there, but. Yeah. Got a knee joint here and a ball jointed feet. Basic little MicroMasters. So, anyway, that was Fuser. And uh, here's Blastmaster. Know what's going on? He got the wheels molded into his arm for landing gear. Red face with the blue. Yeah, very cool. You can see it says NASA on the side here. Wings folded up. Bow joint arms. Nothing with the head. Um, nothing with the waist. Uh, bow jointed legs, they're, they're stiff, very stiff, and uh, you got a knee joint here due to the transformation. 
So, so yeah, not much going on with these guys. So yeah, anywho, let's bring in their original counterparts, shall we? Their original counterparts, the original MicroMasters. There we go. There's one. And here's. Give them a stand here. Two. So yeah, there's their original counterparts. Mine's a, my set is a little bit yellow, uh, a little faded. That's I wouldn't say it's yellow. It's like faded more than anything. But uh, I picked that set up a while back at the Green Castle Toy Show. If I find a, a better set, I'll probably pick them up. But it just shows its age, though. But uh, you can see what they did with the difference, difference with these guys. It's pretty cool. So, so yeah. So yeah, if you have like uh, um, the target, uh, like the battle maskers and all that, your size comparison with uh, sound barrier. Give you size comparison with that. There you go. So yeah. And, uh, yeah, anywho, had a brain fart there. So, yeah, these guys are supposed to uh, transform and combine into shuttle mode, and then there's a gun mode for them. And uh, the way they do their gun mode, I think we'll do the shuttle first. I think, brain fart, brain fart. No, it's like these guys don't have a gun mode. I was thinking of the race car. I thought these guys had a gun mode though, but I guess not. But uh, these guys actually combine together. So we're gonna go ahead and grab the front part, pull this back, pull this arm forward. But before we do that, we're gonna up, rotate at the waist here, and accordion this up. Fold his arms down, clip that in, clip this in like so. There's one half of the shuttle. Next. Anywho, without someone uh, notifications going on, on my phone, these guys will transform into their jet mode, their shuttle mode. What you do here is just fold his legs up and around. It'll make sure they're put together too. Cording them, bring the wing back, and they should tab in. Just got a tab in it, and there we go. I'm bring the shuttle wings down. Little tab in. There we go. And all you have to do is uh, these tabs, white tabs right here on each side here, will go into these slots right here and here. And there we go. We got them in the shuttle mode. Yay! So there's Astro Squad. So yeah, very cool. <laughs> So yeah, you got the little, uh, not much with the landing gear, but you got the post here. Oh, and I almost forgot to fold his head back in there. <laughs> so yeah, anyway, we'll be back for final thoughts here. Anywho, final thoughts on the Astro Squad. And uh, before we do that, uh, details, you got the blue right there for the windows. NASA on the side there. So yeah, not much going on. You can actually take uh, these pegs here and actually peg them on uh, ironworks or a grease pit. So, so if you have a take this on, always like you have this hole right there. You can dock for uh, fueling, which is cool. You just had to get rid of the sign there. You know, let's put the sign somewhere else. We'll put the sign over here. Yeah, that looks good, okay, right? So. Anyway, you can dock right there to get fuel. It's cool. So, yeah. So, yeah. Transform these guys. The Astro Squad is that uh, MicroMaster team is awesome. And it's glad that we got MicroMasters back once again. And, uh, yeah, I highly recommend you guys and gals trying to pick these guys up. Um, he's a little top heavy. But, uh, 
I'll flip his wings out a little bit to give him a little bit of. Come on. There we go. Blastmaster, anyway. <laughs> But uh, rotate. He has the cleanest transformation fuser does. So, so yeah, there is my review on the new Transformers Earthrise uh, MicroMaster Team Astro Squad. And uh, yeah, it's a very cool, cool uh, set, and uh, I highly recommend it, ladies and gentlemen. So yeah. So yeah, not much I can say about these guys. Uh, it's very neat. Highly recommended, and. Uh, Lots of playability to go on with your uh, your grease pit, your uh, ironworks, whatever little MicroMaster bases we get in the near future with the Transformers line. So, yeah, not much I can say. So, yeah, especially whenever you got the original original ones right here to go with. Uh, oh, wrong hands. The original ones here to go with uh, this original set. So you got the original and then you got the remakes. So, which is pretty cool. So, yeah. So like I said, ladies and gentlemen, I'm your host, Transactor here talking again. Don't forget to rate and subscribe, comment. When any videos you do, keep a look out for any new videos headed your way. And definitely uh, don't forget to check out everybody else's links down in the description down below. So until next time, ladies and gentlemen, I hope you guys enjoyed the awesome review of the new Transformers Earthrise War for Cybertron Trilogy Fuser and Autobot Blastmaster Astro Squad Micromaster Team. So until next time, I'm your host, Transactor here talking again. I'm out of here, and uh, we're going to fuse our bodies together and blast off. Get it? Yeah.